young. Well, I've been coming here since I was 10 years old. Clifford Barassa has been eating seafood at Young's Lobster Pound in Belfast for nearly 80 years, but the price has gone up a bit since then. Lobsters was 30, 35 cents a pound. These days, the price per pound that has those in the lobstering industry worried is that of bait herring. According to the Maine Department of Marine Resources, the average price per pound of the lobster's favorite food has tripled in the last 10 years, going from 12 cents in 2008 to about 36 cents this year. And that increase really adds up. This exactor holds three barrels of herring. Here in Lincolnville, the lobstermen tell me that just one of these costs $575 and they go through at least one a day. That's a huge amount of money. Most boats, when they bait up and leave the dock in the morning, they're several hundred dollars backwards. Data from the DMR shows the least amount of herring caught last year since 2010. Catch quotas are about to fall even more in 2019 as the New England Fishery Management Council announced last month a plan to cap catch quotas for the next three years. But lobstermen and buyers say the price of lobster has barely changed. Well, the cost of bait's gone up, the cost of labor's gone up, boats, equipment, everything has gone up, but the life price, price of lobsters really hasn't gone up. It's an uncomfortable pinch, but Mike Hutchings has been lobstering for 50 years and has seen the best and worst of the situation. He says the height of the lobstering season is just getting started and advises wait and see. We're fishermen, we'll figure out a way to make it work. In Lincolnville, Katie Bavoso, New Center, Maine.